Okay, uh, good morning, students. Uh, uh, today our topic of discussion is uh, graphs. Okay, so today we will uh, learn about the graphs. We will learn about the uh, coordinates in the graphs, so on and so forth. Okay, so as we are talking about the graphs, so a graph has got uh, two main parts, two main axes. One is x-axis, okay, and the and the one is y-axis, okay. This uh, vertical column is the y-axis, okay. I mean this verti vertical axis is the y-axis, and this horizontal axis is the x-axis. So this is the x-axis, and this is the y-axis, okay. Okay, so on the left side of the uh, uh, x-axis, uh, we have all the uh, negative values, and on the right side of the x-axis, we have all the uh, positive values. In the center we have zero, uh, both for the x-axis and y-axis, and the upper side of the y-axis we have all the positive values, and the lower side of the y-axis we have all the negative values. Okay, so keep that in mind. Okay, so uh, now we will learn some coordinates. Okay, so what are the coordinates? Basically, coordinates are the values of x and y. Okay, so here if you can see that it's minus three and minus five. It means minus three is x and minus y is five. Okay. You should follow this order, okay? And whatever, the, whatever uh, the coordinate comes as first, that is called as the x coordinate, and the second coordinate is called the y coordinate, okay? So always uh, remember that and even break that sequence, okay? The first thing is always the first number is always the the first coordinate is always the x coordinate, and the second coordinate is always the y coordinate, okay? Okay, so what is the first coordinate? It's minus three minus five, okay? So just try to find out minus 3 on the x-axis. So this is the x-axis. So as it is minus uh, 3, so we just need to look into the negative sector of the x-axis. So this is minus 3. Okay. And we have minus 5. So on the y-axis, -x -axis, we have to. First, the first value was on the x-axis. So minus 3 on the x-axis is here. And the second value is minus 5 on the y-axis. So on the y-axis, minus 5 is here. This is minus 5. So minus uh, minus three minus five. This is this is the point. As you can see, this is the point minus three minus five. They have put a cross mark, uh, denoting that uh, this is the uh, minus three minus five coordinate. Okay, the second coordinate is minus two minus three. Same way, this is minus two. This is minus three. They have put a cross sign to denote. <coughs> To denote the uh, coordinate okay uh, then minus 1 minus 1 so minus 1 on the x-axis minus 1 on the y-axis this is the coordinate okay mm, then 0 1 okay F uh, till now we have all dealt uh, with the negative values now we are dealing with the positive values it's uh, the second uh, the next value is 0 and 1 so 0 on the x-axis will be here 0 okay no change okay and one on the y-axis is here, so uh, this uh, they have put a, a cross mark on here, on one because zero one is here because on the x-axis we have nothing, only zero. That's why. Okay, then one three. Okay, so one three, y one on the x-axis, y on three on the y-axis. So this is one three. Okay, they have put a cross mark. Then we have two five. Uh, this is two. This is uh, five. They have put a cross mark. Okay. And then we have 3, 7, uh, this is 3 on the x-axis uh, and 7 on the y-axis, so here they have put a cross mark, okay? Okay, students, uh, that is all for uh, to discuss. Uh, this was all about graph and coordinates. Uh, see you in the next class. Allah Hafiz.